How the cow is. It's weekly walkabout time. We've been flat knacker busy again. We've got a really cool auction this week. Great little wind-up Schuko racer there, made in Western Germany, 1950s thing. Nice little Schuko Piccolo. Little miniature little die casts. You got a uh, Royal Australian Navy Bosun's Whistle and a reproduction Purple Heart. Lovely old sort of Victorian sterling silver collar. Uh, there with the lovely little pendant on the bottom there. Beautiful thing. Fantastic old Popeye money bank. Lovely 1930s evening in Paris perfume box there with the bottle, I think, inside. Notice we've got some interesting old athletics ribbons. Heaps of cards this week. Footy cards, 1980s Scanlon's ones. 1980s Scanlon's Buck Rogers cards. These are great. The little Melbourne Olympics teaspoon set with a nice little pin to go with it. Some American banknotes. Chromo lithos. Little personal uh, spittoon. Good little thing. Fantastic bit this, the dressmaker's dummy with the cage down the bottom of it there. It's all fully adjustable. Fantastic thing, it's in great condition. Really like the little enameled uh, heater as well, little wood, wood, little pot belly or something. A couple of nice little side tables there, arts and crafts. A lovely Art Deco Baker light, light fitting. It's got a spare pair of little bowls there if you want to change them over. A little nest of Parker tables. A uh, little group, lots of retro stuff and some pretty china and stuff. Some more cool clothes, two-piece vintage Speedos, two-piece orange terry toweling. Pretty cool military uniform, and some other vests and shirts and stuff. And else have we got? Group lots of china and art reference books and prints and model kits and pottery. Nice lot of glassware. Old Jumlop volleys and a tennis racket. Boxes of books and stuff. China. Ladies bags, some more plants, more plants. I think a lot of occasional furniture, nice little bits and bobs. These are good, the old golf clubs, some nice old hickory shafted ones in amongst. Box of glasses, heaps of them. They've got reproduction AFL club labels on them. They're all reproduction things, but they're still kind of cool. Old papers, tools, lamps, books, napery, clothing, pictures. And a nice group up with some nice old pickies in amongst that stuff. A couple of cages, kids' toys and gear, CDs and cassettes, gauges, tools, dress patterns, some interesting books. These are cool. Some of these old sort of block-mounted photos there. It's a little Wirraway World War II trainer. Lovely de Havilland Comet. Really cool thing. Really cool thing. There's a Royal New Zealand Air Force Corsair over the back. Nice lot of sort of retro glass and ceramic ashtrays. Skippy plate with some other bits of Australiana. Yeah, some interesting lot of ephemera down the bottom here. What else have we got? Nice little Raypar amplifier. Some American flags. Model kits. Linen. Clocks and gauges. Nice big Chinese watercolour down the frame. Nice big etching. I think it's Van Neest. Something like that. English guy. Another nice English one, the Frederick Farrell. It's a nice little oil painting there as well. A little, lovely little bit, actually. Uh, a little set of four Bronowski colour lithos. They're all nice, colourful parrots and stuff. It's pretty cool. The big New Zealand carving. Big wall hang. A couple of guitars. Coca-Cola poster's pretty cool. Some box Star Wars gear. Some more nice glass. Heaps of cards. They look like... Which are those ones? They're tops ones. The Hulk, I think. Another big lot of 70s glass. Peter Locke's sex magazine record over the back is fantastic with the booklet in it. Great little Viewmaster there with a little Rubik style cube. Some nice West German, another pottery. Linen, cards, china, a couple of cool books. More glass, some packaged kids' toys. More cards, some nice glass. Some more sort of pin up girl stuff. Simpsons cards. Star Wars, Star Wars, and a girdle. Some cool old cups, footy, Premiership, Fitzroy, Premiership, the Demon, some Star Wars cards. More tribal stuff, some cool movie posters in amongst here. Stamps and an old 20 pound banknote. More cards, more glass, Weg mirror, kids toys, some pottery and ceramics. Some cool little dolls. 
More nice little 70s lidded glass jars. Another nice big group lot of coloured art glass. What else have we got? Dukes of Hazard sort of reproduction screen printed posters. Pretty cool. Nice big lot of playing cards and stuff. A swallow's an aerial biscuit tin with an old grave marker. <laughs> like this sign. This is a war saving street tin sign. More packaged toys, some more packaged model kits, cards, tins, Victorian China. Yes, we've got a good little model kit over the back there. Some more cards, a couple of nice little bits of wood. A little card, little sailor man there playing his pipe. And a little kookaburra hand painted. Some more cool New Zealand tribal stuff. Another nice lot of linen and lace. Pin-up girl magazines and books. Some retro wall plates chargers. Big Sid Nolan books, nice. Another nice little tiki, the Mechanical Eye in Australia, photography in Australia from 1840 to 1900. Shelley, some nice Durant, French Crystal, Briley, English, uh, Pacific Tribal Art Books, another nice tiki, a couple of nice bits of glass. These are nice, kind of like these two little dolls, especially because the chick's got a knife in her hand. It's like the opposite of Punch and Judy. Nice deco plaque, wall charger, another nice little Jack Deco German figurine. Another nice carved tiki panel, some retro German and other ceramics, uh, Japanese vase, interesting little bit this, uh, Polish porcelain, real 1950s again. Hey Uncle Mick, Uncle Mick's just turned up, he's going to wander around and see what he can find this week. What else we got down the bottom here, nice big Chaparis reproduction bronze, she's lovely the photograph there of the glamour girl from the 1920s. Carved panels, nice. These are pretty cool. The white furry boots made in Japan. These are great, the little dolls. Niz Tiz, little Barcelona Spanish felt dolls. Pretty cool little combi 1950s radio there with a drop down record player. Some more nice little Spanish felt dolls. Italian glass, cabinet plates. Retro Beswick three piece set. A little bit Fidjo Norway. Three fantastic little Noritake trios. These are nice, they light up under the UV light, so there's a uranium content in the bowls. Have a nice little lot of glass there. Gwyneth Norton, a little Australian arts and crafts, hand-painted vase. Another nice little Spanish felt bull rider. Really nice, the boomerang there. Greetings from this uh, Northern Territory 1945. I've got some nice bits up the top. Peg's Fairy, Peg's Fairy book, uh, first edition. Another nice big bit of Italian glass, Josephina Crosno, uh, Miles Johnson, Dalton Character Jug, the Go Girl Girl Cocktail Mix is fantastic. Nice big Greg Daly Luster Charger. These are really nice, the old sort of milk bar confectionery jars. They're nice with these little textured bits across the front where you could stick an old label for humbugs or something like that. Cool things. Anyway, I could ramble on and show and babble on a bit more about some more stuff, but that'll kind of do. Oh, they're nice, actually, the big model kits down the bottom there. Yeah, there's some more. Heaps of cool toys and cards, presidential stuff, yo-yos, cat bombs. Anyway, guys, hopefully you saw something you liked. You know, I don't really give a rat's if you did or if you didn't. See you on Thursday night.